Slim Wreck TV. You the streets don't love you. Not at all. By now, homie, you should've knew that. Word. Ain't no need no Browns in this town. You a new jack. No now, if you got something on your chest, whether you're going through it in your relationship or you're just going through it with siblings and homies and maybe your homegirls, you can call me up and hit my line and get it off your chest. 310-598-2974 and leave that voicemail and just get it off your chest. Peace. And Wreck TV. Yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm so the album done and I leave, I'm, I'm coming through. But as of right now, I, don't, I ain't going nowhere but right. the studio. Every day I'm in the studio until the shit is done. It's right. done, but it's like, I'm just making as much as I can, my nigga. Like, I want yeah. it to be so fire. So I'm going to keep making hit after hit. Like, if I'm going to make a fucking club song, I make like 10 of them shits. I'm going to make a song for the hood, I make like 20 of them shits. Yeah. Mm -hmm. make a personal song, I make like 30 of them shits. So mm -hmm. I can pick the best yeah. amount mm -hmm. that I need for the album and go. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't stop. That's the drive. That's the drive right there. I can't stop, man. The only way to be to be rich, I got a big family to feed. I'm talking about blood family and fam fam. Yeah. We big, man. I ain't the leader of the black camp. I'm just the voice of it, nigga. Yeah. It's a big fan, nigga. You know what I'm saying? We do the same shit. My man got all kind of responsibilities. We got real bills. We regular motherfuckers, man. You know what I'm saying? I bought that big ass white Hummer. Gotta pay for that shit. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to look like a rapper, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't about just getting head in the truck, nigga. I'm trying to look like a rapper, nigga. Yeah, yeah, right. I'm trying to mingle with these industry niggas. I don't fit in. I'm not like them fags. I'm nothing like them niggas, man. I wasn't raised like that. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm trying to fit in. I'm trying to blend in, man. They won't even notice I'm there, man. I'm just trying to fit in. I feel you, daddy. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. why we yeah, we come see it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, y'all this hood, man. I me? came for Harper today. Yeah. yeah well, something we've been up here since the morning time. Yeah. Yeah. I don't play no game. We, I'm saying? Yeah. That's what's up, man. I, yeah, I'm glad I got y'all, man. I'm glad. Yeah, I'm glad. you know, I, I got a few. We had a few, you know, people to take, to, to do, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Some cash fun it, you know what I'm saying? Some some like, yo, we going to slay. And I ain't come out here for nothing, but yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, that's crazy. I'm glad I ain't do it because a lot of times if I was really, I'm not going to be so busy. I'm like, nah, I can't do it now. But I've been fucked. I'd, I'd have felt fucked up if I did that to y'all and y'all came that far. Yeah. Y'all you know, niggas be right from the hood. Like, y'all said we in Queens. I'm like, I can see these niggas tomorrow or something. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Right, right. Yeah. My manager had called to y'all was in Queens. I thought y'all was somebody from around the nah, way. No, we was in Queens because, matter of fact, we had we just did some footage. Boom. So I, I look at my two-way. I said, damn. And I look and I see your number. I said, damn. Yeah. Let me holler at Duke, you know what I'm saying? Since we in the area, since we around, you know what I'm saying? Maybe he be in the hood, because I seen you a couple DVDs. You straight in the in the hood. Like, you know, giving it up. So I was like, yeah, I know he gonna give up some, yeah, some yeah, heat. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's all we looking for. And that's what's gonna mm -hmm. give it, give it, give it up to us real. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Right. So that's why we hollered at you. I was like, damn, man, yeah, numbers still the same all that like, gravy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, I got the, that's the one thing that niggas be shocked about. Then nigga on, oh, he popping and all that, but he got the same number. Yeah, because yeah. I you know I, I thought you changed it when I heard the Beyonce joint. <laughs> 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 the name ain't the same. The same Call yeah, the niggas. I was like, spot. oh shit. You was like, yo, what up? I was like, oh, what up? What up, son? I was like, yo. I said, man, home probably the, changes numbers, I'm in the man. Same hood. I'm in the same spot. Same man, number. Man. Okay. I'm the same man. But let, let me tell you something. When I get too big and the, and the, 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 the fucking male groupies keep calling my jack, oh, I'm changing it. Yeah. If yeah. I get them now, I'll be, yo, Kraft, what up, son? No, you're not. Yeah. We're not, no, we're not chilling. Yeah. No, I don't want to meet your girl. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, 16? No, I'm not. I can't. can't. Yeah, I feel mm -hmm. you, son. Niggas be mad. This shit, one thing niggas be forgetting is that just because we share the same streets don't mean shit. This is a business. Definitely. If I do a fave, I do it for fam or niggas I fuck with. If I feel the nigga about like, fuck, I'm just going to fuck him. We can do whatever. That's how the streets do it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But That's how the streets do that shit. The rap game is like, just like the crack game. Niggas need to treat it like that because it's just like the crack game. You wouldn't yeah. go up to a strange nigga talking about, yo, let me hustle with you. Nah. Let me get some work from you, but you don't know you expect them to give you work, he don't fucking know you. Yeah. That's how this shit is. My 16 bars, I get paid for that shit. Uh, yeah. That shit is like a pack to me, nigga. It's not yeah. games. I'm like, why would you expect me to do that? Mm -hmm. I do that for fam or I do that for money. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I just do it for fucking fun. I be rapping with the whole world. I don't own nobody's shit. Like, yeah. I've had a nigga that came to me, yo, man, you need to do a song with my man so you know we from the same streets and all. I don't give a fuck where you from. Yeah. I ain't gonna be foul, but that's the wrong way to do it. If yeah. you gonna fuck with a nigga and I feel your vibe, then I do some shit. Yeah, even, fuck with niggas, niggas think you from the same bro. It would have been better off if, if, if he was already Queens, get it because a nigga think, from Queens. Think about, yeah. how, think about how, much, how much niggas live in Queens. I, I would know, have right? no more raps, nigga. I know, right? I bless everybody. I'd be a broke nigga that blessed everybody. Yeah. You respect it more for motherfucker being like, yo, I ain't on yet, but I got 3,000 um, blood money. 
I ain't got ten thousand for you, but I got three thousand <laughs> blood money. Could yeah, you look yeah. out? Then I'd have been more respectful. You you I, might would have said yeah. Come at me like that. I, most of the time, I always look out unless you, yeah. unless you are absolutely trash. Yeah. Like if you gonna hurt my career, people be you know, regular. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, like, yeah, this nigga, you too whack. I can't get the paper, homie. But most yeah. of the time, if you hear me on records with niggas that ain't on, niggas just came on some real shit. I be like, yo, I can fuck with this nigga. I'm feeling what he was feeling this vibe. He talking some shit. Yeah. Get down with it. I ain't on no Hollywood shit like y'all. Like I'm gonna charge attention. I'm gonna charge Jay Z. Yeah. 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 Boy, nigga. Some niggas I did. I blessed. For, for nothing, cause I feel the niggas like, yo, I just feel this nigga vibe, I'm fucking with him. Right, yeah. right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shit, it's a business, man. Yeah. I'm gonna okay. get mad if you're not fam and you like you just met me for the first time and think I'm gonna be fucked. Cause think about how many niggas I meet, man. Hell yeah. yeah. It's like, yeah. God damn, I'm a regular nigga. I'm just think about it. I'm a regular hood nigga. So put yourself yeah. in my shoes. You a regular hood nigga. You don't fuck with niggas when you on the street. So now that you rap, it don't make no difference. You feel the same way about niggas when you meet them. If you just meet some strange nigga like, yo, he. Getting close to you, like what he want from me. If you was right. a hustler, what you think about? Hell yeah. You had a pack and he talked with some slick shit. You be like, what the fuck you trying to do? Yeah, what you snitching what you, what you, what you mm -hmm. right, right. Mm -hmm. And for the record, you know the nigga wasn't scared. The nigga let told him come through. You know you gotta have a code. Shorty gave us a code. Come right up. He ain't know what the fuck was going on. Mm -hmm. So you already know. Nigga said, yo, what's up? You got a camera? Let's go. You feel mm -hmm. me? So another nigga wouldn't even let you up here. You feel me? Wouldn't even like, yo, 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 you can't come up here. Yeah. Meet me somewhere. They want the security like, to see you first. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you know. It's straight. It's this, 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 this flavoring street DVD. You know what I'm saying? That's how we so, get down. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's black here. I gotta understand what, I, what, where I'm coming from. I'm not like, I think your average rap label. It ain't like the other rap labels out there. This shit was founded in the streets. Yeah, I've been hearing about. I heard, I heard a lot about Black Hand. Yeah, Black Hand been around from before I was born, my nigga. This shit been around since like the '70s. Yeah, I hear. Yeah, I heard about that. In, in like the federal prisons. Yeah. Mm -hmm. across, the, across the country, you know what I'm saying? It was a group That's of motherfuckers that, that got together <laughs> and, and they stuffed together in the jails. You know, back then, one race, of my man's from Forty Prods told me yeah, about Black Hands. Huh? Chad's from Forty Prods. You know Chad's and my manager. That's yeah, yeah, company. yeah. He yeah. from there. Yeah, from Forty. So yeah, you already know what time it is. Yeah, like, I was like, think, I was like, think about it though. Back in the yeah. days, niggas was um they stuck together in the prisons because they had to, you know, be unified. Yeah, be because strong. yeah, because especially in Fat Jail because. South and all that shit be on some shit. So. It was lynching black niggas back then. It wasn't a fucking gang. They get yeah. one of the Arab, them fucking, um... KKK. Yeah. yeah. Them motherfucking, um, them, them dudes, one of them shivs of son or a big-ass knife. You be handcuffed walking with a CO. You get stabbed all up. You be a dead nigga laying right, in the leak. Right. Yeah. So, you know, niggas stuck together in jail on some real gangster shit and locked it down. And they got so big in numbers, they start, because, you know, niggas be moving around from jail to jail, but they were so bowed it, they couldn't contain yeah. niggas. Yeah. Niggas being so strong in jail, they trying to move niggas around. Mm -hmm. Black hands set spread throughout the whole fucking jails. Damn it, every jail, every federal prison in the country. You know what I'm saying? It's mm -hmm. almost to the point where no matter what jail you went to, if you was fam, you'd have had friends in the jail. Or if you was an enemy, you'd have had enemies in the fucking right, jail. You right. couldn't go nowhere without seeing the fam. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And as niggas came home the, over the years and shit, he went to whatever portion of the country they was from and spread the black hand set wherever they was from. Mm. You know, a jail filled with motherfuckers from all over the country. Yeah. So wherever they from, they went there, boom, and they spread the set. So the set just grows and grows and grows. You know what I'm saying? So right now, Damn. we're like 10,000 deep. Five in, five mm. out, man. It's real serious. Mm. Yeah. Like five fingers of black hand wrapped the five regions of this country. Mm. North, mm -hmm. South, East, West, and the Midwest. You know what I'm mm. saying? Damn. Mm -hmm. that, that's, that's straight. I mm -hmm. like that. That's a history lesson so, right there. Mm -hmm. so. so when you hear black oh, hand, it ain't just fucking, oh, these niggas is beats and rap, so we rapping, yo, my hat back was, I got 16, nigga, fuck that. Mm -hmm. This is real, yeah. nigga. My life yeah. is in these songs. Mm -hmm. But I say as much as I can say, there's a, a lot I can't really say, because... Niggas still on the inside fighting their kids trying to get out, man. Yeah, I, can't I feel you. I, I can't be you. the nigga dry snitching on records just to sell records. Some rappers could do that yeah. and get props for that shit. They can mm -hmm. dry snitch on records. They can say niggas' names. They can describe scenarios. Mm -hmm. I can't do that because it's real here. It ain't me just rapping. Niggas is really fighting life sentences over the shit I got to say or the shit I seen. Mm -hmm. so who the fuck am I to get on record because that shit sound good telling niggas' lives? I can't do that. Mm -hmm. I can say what I did to an extent and I can say what I seen. To an extent, enough for you to know who I am mm -hmm. on the record and make a good song. Mm -hmm. But that's about it. You know what I'm saying? But I put my life on these papers, man. So when you listen to the music, you know it's real. Mm -hmm. I rap like I talk, nigga. It's just what it is. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. so when you hear niggas trying to copy, they just don't sound right because they can't do it. This shit is from experience. This shit is real shit. I'm not just rapping like, yo, I got a beat and I got a story. I don't do that shit. Mm -hmm. Right. Not to say, not to disrespect niggas that do that. Like, yeah. nah, he make them fly stories up and it sound hot. Even cool, uh -huh. all the niggas, they like storytellers, Biggie. I just don't do that. Yeah, I like bro. to hear it, but mm -hmm. when I tell a story, it's some oh, shit that I seen or you know, that happened. Oh, mm -hmm. I don't, you know what I'm saying? But I like that. You know I'm, I'm not oh, talking against yeah, that yeah, shit. Yeah, that's fly too. That's creativity. Mm -hmm. That's all in the artistry and making dope shit.
Shalom. 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 What's, what's, the, what's the new shit y'all about to pop off? What's the shit y'all just did? Man, we got, we got one we just did with Buster, though. That, 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 that might, oh wow, that's cool. Oh, that's great. He on the hook. Mm -hmm. he, he on the remix. It's, it's, it's fire, man. Okay. Mm -hmm. Buster Rhymes just hopped on the yeah. shit. That might be on the album. It's a big record. I got a lot. Me and this nigga got a lot. He's fire, man. Like, when I get to the top of my game, hit the top of his game, when we both our albums out popping, mm -hmm. we gonna do an album together. Mm -hmm. okay. Grab a album and it's right. rap, man. That's gonna be on Black Hand? Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. Definitely. All right. Damn. I wanna hear that shit, man. For yeah. real. Right now, too, I'm fucking with, um, you know, we left the Sony situation. Now I'm fucking mm -hmm. with Dame Dash. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we know. seen it. We seen it somewhere on, um, what it say? Black Hand slash Rockefeller. Yeah. So we, we, we be staying up on all of that. We seen that a few months ago, though. Yeah. Yeah. I brought Dame Dash with me to Case Lay Show, nigga. That, okay. That's the real nigga. Yeah. That's the only CEO that's you know, gonna come out of his crib 12 at night and come to the radio, which, you know, Man. Case Lay on midnight. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He was up there with me rocking out for like an hour. We just popping shit. Mm hmm. Yeah, shout out to Dame Dash for show. Sure. Mm hmm. Okay. Now, if you got something on your chest, whether you're going through it in your relationship, or you just going through it with siblings and homies and maybe your homegirls, you can call me up and hit my line and get it off your chest. 310-598-2974 and leave that voicemail and just get it off your chest. Peace. M Rack TV. M Rack. Y'all wanna stunt and floss on Front Street? The Hulk will tear through your gut, spill out your lunch meat. Damn. You the main vic, they booking for drugs. Niggas starving out here, and you looking like grub. That new M Rack, catch a lick single, aka Money Dance, that's killing the airwaves on Shade 4 or 5 and many different other stations in Connecticut, Boston, so forth and so on. You can get it now, the links is in the video description. It's available on Google Play, Deezer, uh, YouTube Music, Apple Music, Tidal, Spotify, etc., etc. Go get that. One. Slug you, the streets don't love you. Not at all. By now, homie, you should've knew that. Word. Ain't no Nino Browns in this town. You a new Jack. No Browns. Peace, world. To promote your music or promote your business by placing an ad on MREC TV, contact MREC TV promo. M R E C K T V promo at gmail.com. Peace. Oh, yeah. Subscribe to MREC TV. YouTube.com slash MREC TV. I'm gone. M Wreck TV. It's got a music.